iloveshelling.com. And I am at the low tide. It's super moon. It's a really, really low tide. Tarpon Bay Road beach access is way, way, way down there. And look how low this tide is. You can see how cool that we don't usually get to see this exposed. Usually the water is all the way up to here and we don't get to see that sandbar. So anyway, these are the shells I've been finding. Murex, olives, tulips, uh, turbans, uh, what else is in there? Turkey wings, scallops. So it's really cool. So I wanted to show you that they don't just jump out at you. They just don't, you know, jump in your shell bag. You have to walk a long way. I mean, I have walked a long way to find those. Let me put that back into my shell bag. And uh, so I'll have a free hand. Whoops. Turban and an olive just dropped. So, oh, see, and there's another olive right there. Let me get these in here. Oh, there's a live fighting call. Lots of live things at low tide. Lots of live things. Let me get that in there. Okay, and there's an olive. Ooh, and it's got a good, it's missing the top so I can make a little bracelet out of that. Um, let's see. And see all of these half buried, lots of crumbles, and lots of bits of shells. You just see one piece, no, okay. Well, you gotta keep on trying. You see one piece of a shell and a lot may be underneath that sand buried. So there's a lot of stooping to find all the good stuff. So, and I don't want to miss over here. Oh, there's another olive. Pretty. All in. So I've got a lot to look through, and you can kind of go slow. What is that? Oh, look. At, oh, it is a broad paper cockle. I rarely find that. Look how pretty that is. I'm tickled. Tickled to find that. Look at that color. Great. Oh, and there's another olive right there. Nobody home. Lots of sh little shell bits and parts inside them. Another olive. Oh my gosh. Another olive. Nobody home. It's a little damaged, but I like them that way. Let's see. Ooh, oh my. Now that, I want you to, oh shoot, I've, I've muddied up the water now. But I want you to see that right there, what I'm seeing. And you see that, I mean, it could be nothing, it could just be a part, but we could unbury that and it could be a whole true tulip underneath there. So I wanna, nope, see, there's a lot of, there's a lot of that. But you can't get discouraged. That's what the fun of it is. It's a treasure hunt. You find little pieces. Now that's a clue for me that, hey, I could find a true tulip here because they were, they are here. There's pieces of them. So that guy was whole at one time. Uh, that is definitely a piece of a tulip. Oh, there it's a. Oh, look at that. No nope, piece of a tulip. Pretty orange jingle. Love me those jingles. And a lot of people have been, well, I shouldn't say a lot, but there have been quite a few people who have walked this line already. And there are still things here. Not everybody sees the same thing. So I saw this right here. And let's just see. Give that. Yeah, there's a fighting conch. He's a little busted. Nobody home. I'm gonna leave him for somebody else. There's another one. Half buried. That's the clue. Yeah, there it is. Oh, I'm gonna leave that there. That was a good one though. Nobody home. See 
little tiny pieces of them. It's rare that you, well, there's one that's right out in the, out in the open. He's got a few barnacles on him, but he's pretty on the inside. So I'm looking back and forth. I'm looking over here and I'm looking over here. And it's uh, patience, lots of patience. And then I see there's a pin shell there. Get these other things in the back again. You always want to look under the pin shells. Through there. Oh, there's a pretty little conch. And look how sweet. Look at that. Look how sweet that is. Okay, I just wanted to show you my little method when it's low tide like this. Well, there's a lot of a lot of times you're gonna bend down and it's gonna be nothing, but then sometimes, look at that pretty little gem you'll find. Just beautiful with that purple little tip. All righty, here comes Super, Super Shella Clark. Wonder if he found anything. All right, have a wonderful day. Thanks for joining me.